So we will stand up all together, raise our lives up to the sky. With faith and love in our hearts, we will embark. Oh, oh, oh. We will be. Benfica and Athens. Last time these two met, 4-3 to Benfica. So a win for Benfica here. for Benfica here will boost their momentum and red shot what the I don't even think retro was aware of that but it's a goal regardless one for Athens a win for Athens here means if Munich beats Ajax Athens go through depending on how the goal difference goes. That is the sort of mistake Retro could have done without. But it's Rainmaker that gets credited with the goal. Whoa! Rainmaker! Shot saved incredibly by Sultan. Retro demolishing sticks there. Sultan with the shot, Marley with the save. Retro tries to have a crack of his own. But not on this occasion. Retro had a chance to redeem himself there, but... Not to be. Munich aren't overly concerned, but Ajax will be watching this game. Marley saving the shot attempt there. Retro ensuring. Retro ensuring that Benfica don't go ahead. Here comes Retro to redeem himself! Retro demolition sticks again. Wow. 
Wow. <laughs> Minute to go. Still one each. Sticks demolishing Sultan. There it is, all the way! There it is! Retro puts Athens ahead! Superb work there from Retro. And all Ajax will need to do now. Retro tried to get it there. Squall! 3-1! But a win for Ajax... Stays that as it, as it is. Athens will be on minus two. Athens will be on minus two. Ajax will be level. A win for Ajax will ensure they get their place in the last 16. But if Munich win... Athens could still have a chance. But for now... Three one to Athens. Munich and Ajax. Last time they met, it was three nil to Munich. A win for Munich here will ensure that Ajax don't get. Ensure they don't get into the last 16. And Munich are the home team. Very dominant throughout this campaign. A very strong goal difference as well. Regardless, we are guaranteed one. We've guaranteed ourselves a British team in the Champions League. <clears throat> Marley demolishing slider. Goose with the shot, Merlin with the save. Interestingly, today we've only had one overtime game. Goose with the short slider, another save. And here comes. Oh! Retro tried to go for it there, but he couldn't get the target. And there we go! Ajax 1-0 up. The way it stands, because Ajax have the better goal difference heading into this game, all they need to do is beat Munich, and they prevent Athens from advancing into the last 16. 
Athens need Munich to win, however, to ensure they get into the last 16. Very well played there from Retro. All the way up to the opposite end of the field. Here he comes! Marley with the shot. And Marley goes level. Marley puts Munich level. Slider with the shot there. Retro credited with the clearance. 90 seconds left. Here comes... Oh! Here comes Retro! Superb finish! And that puts Munich 2-1 up with 60 seconds left on the clock. There's Goose going all the way. Samara, def Samara preventing the goal. Very good defensive work there. But I don't think it's going to be enough to try and salvage a place in the last 16. Munich's win ensures Athens survive and progress to the last 16. Manchester City are going to need to wait for now. Shakhtar, Donetsk and Hoffenheim. Last time look. Last time these two teams met, it was 4-2 to Donetsk. In their previous group games, Shakhtar... Last time uh, out, Shakhtar Donetsk won 1-0 against Manchester City. And Hoffenheim beat Leon 5-3. Again, Shakhtar beat Hoffenheim 4-2 last time they met. A win for Donetsk. 
means it's between Lyon and Manchester City for that last slot in the last 16. An abysmal campaign from Paris Saint-Germain earlier. Six games, six losses, zero points. Not the sight you wanted to see if you were a PSG fan. The retro, there it is! One for Hoffenheim, here we go! Bandit with the defensive work there, well played. Leon and Manchester City are going to be watching this game with bated breath, and Retro makes it two! What did he say? That's three. And oh, wow, we indeed. This has been a fantastic competition so far. Demolition there, but oh, what a finish that is! 4 1!
Retro tried to get the shot there, but it wasn't to be on the day. Retro with the shot! Beautiful hat trick! Fury credited with the assist. And Fury straight from kickoff! 6-1, Hoffenheim! This doesn't bode well for men. This doesn't bode well for City or Leon. Does not bode well for them at all. Oh! Well, well, Manchester City and Leon, you may as well kiss goodbye to the last sixteen. I mean, I mean, Rachel, Rachel's just standing there. Didn't need to do anything else. He was done for the day. Now, mathematically, Manchester City need seven goals. They need to win by seven goals. To have any chance of securing their slot in the last 16. Leon only need five. But with the goal difference Hoffenheim have over the pair of them, it's very unlikely, but we never know what's going to happen. Here we go. Last time Leon met Manchester City, it was 4-3 on the day to City. Now, if the same result happened here today... Oh, what a save from Retro! Absolutely amazing. I say Manchester City needs seven goals throughout this game and realistically need to keep a clean sheet as well. But here comes Retro! There we go! There we go! We could be on to something!
One down, six to go for City. Retro went for the shot there. Oh. Opportunity comes knocking. Oh! Well, there's the clean sheet gone. City now need to score eight. City have more pressure than Leon. Leon only need to win by five to go through on goal difference. City need to win by seven. Hoppenheim made their debut in the Champions League last season. They are watching this with a lot of bated breath. And they could still reach the last 16 here. Well, it's two for City now. Not right. Retro with the shots. Definitely giving it a lot of effort. Thirty seconds left. City don't stand a chance. They're not gonna get it. They're not gonna get into the last sixteen. They will, however, be in the Europa League last sixteen. As a third place team, I believe. Not right. Nope, they're gonna go in as a fourth place team. Bittersweet for City. Oh, it was Leon. I've been doing that game wrong the whole time. I think it was City that were the home team. The home team always plays in blue. 
Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, thanks for the corrections, Mr. Dimmerdome, <laughs> So here we go. Group G now. A huge shock that Real Madrid are going to be going through. AS Roma and Victoria Plazen. Essentially, whoever wins this game, whoever wins this game goes through to the last 16. They're pretty much tied on goal difference, but if Roma win by at least two goals, that's it. They go through. Victoria Plazen, if they win, they go through. Now, actually, AS Roma could still go through with a 1-0 win, basically. Yeah, like I say, whoever wins this match goes through to the last 16. CSKA Moscow are through. Real Madrid are out. It's all down to these two now. Now, this will be interesting if... I mean, the, I mean, look at the goal difference between Plazen and, and CSKA Moscow. Plus 9 against minus 5. Um... Okay. Retro with the shot, Marley with the save. What a save from Fury! A great shot from Retro though. Wrong sport. Wrong sport. Demolition on Marley. We're Marley and Marley. I almost conceded a goal. We're Marley and Marley. And now we're losing the game. <laughs> yeah, over the course of the weekend, I decided to watch the Muppet Christmas Carol. What a fun. There goes Mr. Humbug. 
There goes Mr. Grimm. If they gave a prize for being mean, the winner would be him. And there is the Equalizer! Shepard with the Equalizer. Seconds left. <clears throat> Retro with the shot. Couldn't quite find the target. Molly demolished by Retro. And Plazen just got themselves 2-1 up. Shepard just equalized! about that. Here we go. And it's overtime. Nothing worse than seeing your team lose in overtime. And there's Retro! Whoa! Two epic saves in one! Retro takes his hat off to him. Retro tried to go for the shot there, but it wasn't to be. Marley with the shot.
Koto tried to go for the shot there, but it wasn't to be. These two teams... Who's going to who's gonna capitalize? Who's going to see the first opportunity to really go for it? Oh! Molly demolishing retro! Tex went for the shot there. Not finding the target. Two minutes of overtime left. Wrong sport. Wrong sport. Golden opportunity! Retro credited with the assist! Tex wins the game in overtime. There we go. AS Roma are going through. Madrid and CSKA Moscow now. CSKA Moscow guaranteed to finish top of the group now. It was 3-1 to Plzen last time they faced off against Roma. CSKA Moscow beat Real Madrid 1-0 last time they met in the previous group games. Their previous group games, it was AS Roma. One nil win against Madrid, and Victoria Plzen losing six three against CSKA Moscow. So the group is the group is not going to change. Madrid can't. Madrid are stuck at the bottom. Regardless of what happens. CSK and Moscow stay top regardless. It was just that battle for second place. And that's it. Beast with the shot. Rex with the save. Retro. Oh! Mountain and Beast with two sh saves. One from Retro and one from Beast. Demolition on Rainmaker from Retro. Viper with a great save from Beast Shot there. Both teams very good with their defensive work. Viper demolishing Rainmaker. Retro preventing the goal. Mm. 
Retro Demolishing Mountain. Almost got the goal there. 90 seconds left. Who knows? Less than a minute to go. Great opportunity from Retro, but that wasn't happening. Oh no! A goalless overtime, here we go! Good job on the defensive end. And Rex wins the game for Moscow. Well, Juventus, well, Valencia are pretty much out. But, oh my goodness me. This is going down to the final match of the group stages. Because, between the young boys, Juventus and Manchester United, one of them ain't going through. One of them is going to have to settle for the Europa League. All the young boys have to do is win to guarantee their slots. But even if the, but even a win for Valencia, depending on the goal difference, could still prevent Juventus from getting through to the last 16. Oh boy. Hold on to your seatbelts, folks. This is going to be a barnstormer. Young boys and Manchester United first. Young boys, the last time they met, lost 3-2 to Manchester United. But they won 4-3 against Valencia, ensuring that Valencia finished bottom of the group. Then you have... Retro two shots there, nope! Tex with a shot, Marley with the save. Manchester United in a 4-3 thriller against Juventus last time out as well. Here comes Retro! Absolutely brilliant. Manchester United 
could still go through if results go their way. Juventus and Valencia will, well, Juventus in particular will be watching this game so they know what they need to do to ensure that they get a slot in the last 16 of this competition. Failing that, they're going to have to settle for the Europa League. They almost settled for the Europa League last time out and group, and this group would have been all but done. It would have just been a matter of who finished where in the top two. And Retro gets a goal for the young boys. Hound credited with the assist. Absolutely brilliant there. Absolutely brilliant from Retro. Retro sees the... If Tex hadn't gotten away, Retro would have had that second goal. My goodness me. Hound with the shot, Sentis with the save. Sentis with another great save from Shepard's shot this time around. Great work there. Retro puts the young boys 2-0 in the lead. Fantastic work there. Thirty seconds to go. And the young boys will ensure, more or less, that they get their place in the last 16 and they are going to finish top of the group. Oh! Perhaps I may have spoken just a little bit too soon. Wall credited with the assist on Stinger's goal. How's about that? Could we still see overtime here? No, we won't. Manchester United need Valencia to win. To have a chance of going through to the last 16. Manchester United need Valencia to win by three goals. 
to ensure United go through on goal difference. So there we go. The young boys have secured their slot. Can Juventus do the same? Here we go. Last time Juventus met Valencia. It was 6-1 to Juventus on the day. Now a result like that in Valencia's favour... Will ensure United, Manchester United go through. Squall with the shot, sticks with a great save there. A fantastic save there from Sticks again. Squall shot this time. Finding there from Retro. Two and a half minutes to go, still nil nil. Retro demolishing squall. I've always wondered how they managed to come up with come up with the names of these uh, characters. And there is Valencia 1-0 up. That's the first goal that United needed Valencia to score. One down, two to go. And it's a 3-0 win that will ensure United go through to the last 16 of the Champions League. And Juventus will need to ask themselves, where did it all go wrong? That was almost an equaliser there. Wait just a minute. Oh, off the post. <sighs> Retro demolishing Shepard there. Another demolition there.
sticks with the shot. Fantastic there from the team. Thirty seconds to go. Even with Valencia winning, Juventus will still go through on goal difference. And Retro with a spectacular equaliser. We're going into overtime. That's it. Because we're in overtime now, Juventus know they cannot be overtaken in the group. They've guaranteed their slot in the last 16 by taking it to overtime. But can they finish with the win? Not quite on this occasion. Great save there from Maverick. Another demolition there by Retro. Viper with the shot. Another demolition from Retro. Fantastic work there. Shepard with the shot. Still in the danger area. And another demolition. Gets the extermination award there as well. Viper with the shot. And another demolition from Retro. How many more demolitions is he going to get? Well, there's another one on his tally. Maverick with the shot. Squall with the save. And another demolition! I think Retro's demolished everyone in the team. And there's another one on the tally. I don't even know how many demolitions he's had today. And another demolition! Wrong spot! Oh!
absolute chaos! Maverick with the shot there. Not finding the target on this occasion. 60 seconds of overtime left. What's going to happen then? Another demolition and another extermination. Sticks demolishing Viper. And Shepard gets the win for Valencia. It's a win for Valencia. But that won't be enough for United to go through. That's it. Well, there we go, folks. That is it. And we also now have the official bracket for the last 16 of the Champions League. What an amazing group phase we had. But how's everything going to shape up? We'll just need to wait and see. Until then, hope you enjoyed what you saw. If you did, as always, hit the thumbs up. And if you want to be baptized into following this channel, hit the subscribe button down at the bottom. Click the bell to join the Latter-day Saints notification squad so you don't miss anything I do on this channel. Previous video on the left. Rocket League playlist on the right. Reactions tomorrow. Until then, enjoy the rest of your day. Peace out. Stay faithful as always.